We have discussed the character of Cecil Stedman from the Invincible Universe, but you wouldn't be surprised to learn that his origin story is actually pretty interesting as well, as Cecil didn't always have that crazy scar on his face. In fact, way back in the day when Cecil was still a field agent, he was captured by a group of villains and eventually needed to use a secret communicator to lead a hero named Brit to his location. As Brit shows up like Rambo and accidentally scares the villains into releasing their new bioweapon right away, watching themselves get turned into red twisted bodies as their skin begins to change. Unfortunately, Stedman himself was attached to the gas canisters that this is coming from, so most of his face and body had already been changed by the time that Brit was able to get a hold of him and gets him out of the smoke. Eventually, we see that Stedman was given a whole new set of real skin somehow by the government, but he chose to keep the scar by his mouth because it was the only part of the original him that could be salvaged and wants a reminder to never let this happen again. Months later, when the Serpent Society attacks the Pentagon, Cecil kills the villains who did this to him when he finds out that they were brought back as heroes for the government, and this gets him landed in jail for his actions. But he won't stay there long as they're going to need him to win over a certain alien on his way to Earth right now.